New reporting tonight after that deadly and horrific school bus accident in Indiana. A young woman, 24, in a pickup truck, hitting four children, killing three members of the same family. Tonight, new images of a witness walking up to the scene right afterward, and we now know what the driver of the truck is now saying. We do know she had three children in the car with her. ABC's Alex Perez is right there again tonight. Tonight, our first look at those chaotic moments in Rochester, Indiana. First responders on the scene, the hood of the pickup that hit the children mangled. I said, he knew it. I knew I heard the school bus. <sighs> Horrified neighbors rushing outside after hearing the crash that killed twin brothers Xavier and Mason Engel and their sister Olivia while walking to their school bus. The driver of that pickup truck, Alyssa Shepard, charged with three counts of reckless homicide. She told investigators she doesn't normally take this road. She had three kids in the back seat and saw flashing lights, but by the time she realized it was a school bus, it was too late. Tonight, growing questions about the safety of that bus stop. The sibling's uncle says the family had contacted the district in the past about moving the stop away from the road. There's plenty of room for a school bus to pull in here to pick up these kids instead of asking them to walk across to highway with people doing 50, 60 miles an hour. The children were crossing this busy road where the speed limit on this stretch is 45 miles per hour. A 2018 national survey of school bus drivers found that on a single day, nearly 84,000 vehicles passed their buses illegally. Just today in Lee County, Mississippi, another child struck and injured while getting on the bus. David, school officials announced they will be moving that bus stop. Instead of stopping on this busy road, it will now wind its way through the side streets of this neighborhood. David? Alex Perez with us again tonight. Alex, thank you.